in a big, beautiful, loving planet called Earth. I was thinking about what would be the perfect, what would be the 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 best topic to talk about in today's vlog, and then I got to realizing that you know, waiting is an important thing in life because everyone, at least for me. And this is just me. I'm not saying that every single person feels this way, but look, waiting is the is the the best thing to do. Being patient is another um, thing I want to talk about. And what I mean by this is every relationship that I've ever had, for I, I should say relationship because that's not the right word. Every friendship I've ever had started out with me waiting for it to happen. And trust me, you know, not, not every friendship, but a, a good majority of them. And when I, when I do eventually get into a relationship with a woman, you know, I've waited a long, 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 long time. And I will continue to wait however long it takes. And it may take another year. It may take another five years. It may take another 10 years. It may be taking a less than that. But that's what I do best is I'm, I like to be patient and I like to wait. You know, not every person likes to wait or be patient. They want to jump into something. And when they jump into something before they're ready for it, that just proves that that relationship will not last. And however long it takes me to, or however long, much longer I need to wait, I'm going to be okay with that. I'm not saying things are gonna, you know, happen overnight because they don't. Not everything happens overnight. You have to wait a little bit. You have to be patient. You have to do this thing and that thing and all of these, you know, difficult things that happen. But when 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 it does happen, I will be 100% ready for it. I may not be 100% ready for it now because. I'm still trying to figure out who I am and what I want to be. And it may take me another like three months, six months, a year, um, five years. I don't know how much longer it's going to take. But I'm, I'm going to wait until I'm perfectly ready to, to, to be in that situation where, or not situation, but in that relationship with whoever it may be. You know, I've said it time and time again on this channel, on this YouTube and YouTube videos before, and on this channel, that it has to be someone from the celebrity world or the the famous world or things like that. And I stand by that to this day. She has to be from that world, but that doesn't mean I don't have an open mind. You know, I'm not saying I'm gonna ever, you know, uh, put a relationship on social media because, you know, that's something that has to be discussed in, in a relationship, whether it's someone who is famous or someone who's not famous or someone who's, you know, you know, things like that. And I'm, I'm perfectly okay with waiting. I'm, I, I've been waiting for a long time and I can t continue to wait and be patient because that's who I am. And not everyone's going to like me. I get that. Not everyone's going to love me. I get that. You know, but someone somewhere in the world will like me and want to be in a relationship with me or will love me and wants to be in a relationship with me. I'm not saying it's going to happen. It's going to happen anytime soon, but, but you always got to keep an open mind and keep an open heart and all of that stuff. Sure. You know, having an open heart and open mind can lead to bad, bad stuff, but you got to be open about how things are, how things work and how things are. And you've got to be learn to be patient um, uh, and, and wait for the right scenario or the right relationship to come about. It's not going to be easy. It's not going to be something that just happens in a day. It takes time. And I, I know I may not have all the time in the world, but I will wait as long as it takes. That's all I'm saying. I will be as patient as I need to be in regards to finding the the person that I'm supposed to spend the rest of my life with, uh, wherever she may be in this world. 
And yes, it is a woman. And it will continue to be a woman for the rest of my life. And it has always been a woman for the past... For the, for the, for the, you know, last 30 something years, well not 30, let's say 15 years or 20 years, it, it's, and even before that, you know, just because I haven't been in a relationship personally, doesn't mean I don't think I can be in one. I'm just waiting for the right, right woman to come along and wait for the right, right uh, person for me in my life. However long that takes, that's that's not up. That's not up to me. It's up to her. Then you know, I'm not gonna sugarcoat this and say that you know, it 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 really depends. It's not all on me. It's it's always there's always two people in a relationship. That for me it'd be a woman. For her it'd be me. But who knows when that's gonna happen? You know. I'm hoping that something good happens to me when I go to that YouTube convention I talk a lot about next summer, and we'll go from there. And it doesn't have to be, you know, right away. It could take it could take the whole weekend. It could take a month after. It could take six months after. It could take a year after. I don't know the full extent of everything just yet. But I know that waiting and being patient is what I'm good at because I've done it so much in my life. I've been patient my entire life in regards to a relationship. Um, even though I've never been in a relationship with a woman, I know that being patient is the most important thing. And communication. I love to talk. You guys know that because you've watched my vlogs for the past uh, 12 years or 12 years in a couple of months. You know, and just because I don't talk, I don't like communicate all that well sometimes, everyone has anxiety, whether it be social anxiety, awkward, you know, something like that. Um, I love to talk though. I'm not saying I would dominate a conversation though. I'd let her talk and then I would answer her question and then we would communicate through that and not have her, not just be a one-sided conversation. Anyways, I know that that was kind of a big rant and me talking about being patient and waiting and relationships and all of this stuff. But that's what I was thinking about right before I filmed this this vlog earlier or um, this vlog today. It I didn't mean to say earlier. I just admit. And then we're trying to. I'm still trying to figure out like details of the Patreon and how we're going to make that better. I've I've got three tiers on there right now. I don't I'm not gonna put the link in today, but maybe in the future I will. And maybe we'll we'll figure stuff out and make uh Patreon worthwhile and make it awesome. My Patreon. Um I'm still working on some some tier tier related stuff with perks and you know how everything would work. I still have the shout out one, so if you want to be it's only one dollar. Um, and then there's two other ones I'm not going to get into right now, but I'm thinking about fourth and fifth, uh, tier ones. I don't, I don't know what those are going to be yet. I don't know what the perks are going to be yet, but I'm working on it because that's what I'm doing is trying to figure out the best way to, to make it worthwhile for every single person who donates to, or, um, uh, yeah, donates to that specific tier each month. Anyways, we got one birthday to wish today, so let's just get into that. I want to wish Jason Nash a happy birthday, and that does it for birthday today. We have three tomorrow, three or four tomorrow, and then we're getting down to the end of the birthdays for the month of May, and, we're, and then we're going to be moving into June. So there's only, what, uh, eight days left of the month of May, and I will see you tomorrow with a brand new vlog, and bye-bye.